Hey! Wow! Welcome to Dungeons and Dramaturgy on Nightheart Gaming Network. Gaming Network? What am I calling? It's Nightheart Gaming. It's not Network. Yeah. yeah. Sorry. We're uh, apparently our computer thought we were starting on uh, Eastern Time today, or or no, you know, uh, almost Pacific Time. So we had some mountain mountain, mountain time. Yeah. There we go. That's the. It's either almost Pacific, uh, Pacific and Central, right? There's no mountain time. Well, and then there's Arizona. It's like its own little pocket. They just don't observe. Yeah. Well, anything, they don't count. Right? Yeah. They're the best. <laughs> so thank you for hanging in there. If you have been, we appreciate it. And uh, we got all the, we got most of the technical things worked out. At least enough we can get going. Um, thank you, Sirenscapes, for our background. I'm going to spin through this real quick because I don't know how long we can go over. I uh, know that I'm going to thank everybody in the end after they've been working here. My name's Frank. I am the Dungeon Master today. This is a Dungeons & Dragons 5e campaign. It's homebrew. Uh, so, um, although mostly out of the book rules, I'll let everybody introduce themselves. Starting with... Uh, my name is Brad, and I'll be playing Lom. I'm Anne. I'll be playing Ted Bet. I'm Patrick, and I'll be playing as Jules. I'm AJ, and I'll be playing as Ophie. And, and I'm Tom, and I will be playing Wilster. Yeah, so Tom is joining us via Skype. Uh, we don't hide that anymore. We no. thought for just a brief moment we might, but... <laughs> We're not clever. <laughs> no. <laughs> it's better just to own it. Yeah. I was going to play Juice, but apparently Patrick's going to play Tom's Juice. Not yeah, I'll play Juice today. <laughs> I mean, if you want to play Juice, you can be Juice. I'll be Wilster today. This no, cool. no, that's no, all right. I'll just start throwing rocks at everybody. Right. Wow. So I am going to... Um, roll a die and I'm going to be part of this role and that depending on that role we'll find out who's going to give us a little recap on what happened two weeks ago uh, let's see I believe I was one that makes you two it makes you three it makes makes Mr. Patrick the one that's going to do the recap for us. Oh, okay. Uh, or Juice. I don't know. You or Juice can do the okay, recap. Okay, okay. I'll do it. I'll do it. Now, so um, I <sighs> believe when we last left off, we um, we had kind of gotten through dealing with some horrific monsters and stuff and had found some cool things and eventually made our way to a camp. Um Along the way, though, we stumbled across some ruins. A uh, little kind of looked like what was left of uh, some sort of a tower. Uh, and it was kind of collapsing in on itself. And it pretty obviously there was some death that had been going on. And it looked like it was actually Karen. Karen? Karen. Karen, Karen, Karen was Karen. the... Yeah. There was our, it was the guy that took us to uh, Finders in the first place. Apparently, he met his demise here. There was, he was dead. There was blood everywhere. Um, and we tried to pilfer and then examine the place, but ended up getting our teeth kicked in a little bit and the tower falling on us by something we couldn't even see. So we tried to hightail it just about as fast as we could. Uh, um before we finally made it to where the um, the trade days, the bazaar, the annual meetup for some trading to go on. And we lucked out and happened to find a, f a few people that were lingering about. And uh, there was a group of elves that were uh, apparently not familiar with what we had to deal with on a daily basis. Uh, uh such as you know juice and wilster what we're accustomed to anyways uh and we're handing out uh food and clothing and basic necessities and was just trying to get a little bit of information of what life was like out here and so we bartered a little bit gained a little bit of insight and information from them uh, before we decided to venture north uh in search of a guardian, I believe. No, just the gnomes. Just the gnomes. We're the looking. Gnome. The gnomes are north. Yeah, the gnomes. <laughs> so there's there's apparently some nor some gnomes up north. And Northerly gnomes. Northerly gnomes that we're <laughs> going to go out and find. That's right. Uh, also, 
Do, is there something about a guardian up there with them? Do they got a guardian? Or no, no, we have guardians. Oh, we are the guardians. We have a guardian. Of the galaxy. <laughs> yes. Guardians of the fantasy ground. Yes. Yes. Guardians of the fall. Oh, yeah. Guardians of the fall. Yeah. Oh, yeah. <laughs> what a ragtag. Guardians, Guardians of the fifth edition. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, so I, I guess that's about it. I mean, no, in a good. nutshell. Yeah. You okay. guys struck off to the north. That was where we ended it. We're going north. Mm-hmm. Yeah. Through, through blinding snow and blizzard. No. No, not that far north. No. Well, okay. no. Not yet. <laughs> you can't move that far. There's, there's been Quietly. no, there's no traveling scene, you know, so uh-huh. you didn't like travel a hundred miles. Oh, I don't know if maybe like. We can have a montage. Yeah. I was about to say, is there, was there a montage in between episodes? That's, <laughs> that's exactly what I mean. There was no montage. Okay. Aww. All right. Mm-hmm. That's cool too, though. Kind of a bummer. That's all right. Okay. Cool. Is everybody familiar with that? Everybody, nobody adding anything that was important to them? Was there anything important to you that I missed out or excluded just so, you know? We got bread. We got bread. It was delicious bread. We got bread. so much bread. Oh, oh yeah. you, failed, you failed to mention that the elves are probably evil and can't be trusted. Oh, yes. I, I, do, I do apologize. The elves are great. <laughs> I love them. They're cool and they gave us free bread. Yes. Yeah. <laughs> They even hooked That's me up with some cool new threads. I was you super got happy. a skirt. And yeah. you got spells. I got a nice skirt Not and a blouse. Yeah. Thing. It was beautiful. <laughs> Pants. Yeah. <laughs> Ophie got secret and a, spells. And Kool-Aid. <laughs> All the Kool-Aid you can drink. Yeah. I mean, I mean, I mean until it runs out, of course. <laughs> <laughs> okay. That sounds good. Oops. That works for me. Okay. In that case. Now, you also have two horses. Yeah, we, we managed to, to, to keep the horses, and we've been trying to take care of their wounds the best we can, you know, doctoring them up and keeping them clean and bandaged, because one of them got hurt a little bit. Okay, so let's go down to where our players are walking north. Across the various mountainsides. Yeah, yeah. So, you're set up here, walking north. It's... Interesting terrain. You would say that um, it's a little bit hilly. It's like foothills of the mountains, but it's also uh, in any of the low laying areas, it's swampy. It reeks a little bit of rot and dead. So water doesn't have a great runoff point from here. Mm. So you have a lot of uh, nice dry high ground. And you have a lot of really stagnant water. The mosquitoes are are unpleasant. There, there are plenty of mosquitoes around. That's not something that went away. It's a good thing I got dick fur. Keep them off of me, you know. All I heard was dick fur. Oh, I got dick fur all, <laughs> all over my body. Dick fur all over your body. <laughs> <laughs> Thanks for staying on brand. <laughs> <laughs> My brand no, is butt, case, not anybody. dick fur. Well, I mean, okay. Same general reason. Yeah, she's expanding. She's expanding like any good corporate. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I mean, yeah, yeah. It was hard to find a uh, a uh, a clip to show that wasn't full of foul language, which says a lot since clips are only so long. <laughs> oh, no. <laughs> <laughs> well, the best clips, the, my favorite ones had a lot of foul language because we're funniest. <laughs> we're funniest when we're foul. <laughs> yes, funniest when foul. That's a good kind of tagline. Yeah. Perhaps we're foul when we try to be funny. Mm. Yeah. Uh, I think everybody here church. just likes funniest talking about dicks foul. and butts. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. You said dick. Oh, no. <laughs> I said thick, but apparently with juice talk, you you hear bad stuff in your yeah. ears. I told you you got weird brain. <laughs> I, I think it's called poo brain. You got poo brain. <laughs> poo brain. I th- when I hear poo brain, I just think about the horse in uh, it, was it Adventure <laughs> Time? <laughs> yeah, exactly. <laughs> He's, that horse has got poo brain. <laughs> Tell me how well you guys are looking around. Do it with your dice. Oh. <clears throat> well, I say I'm paranoid. Let's see what the dice say. Uh, I, seven. Not so much. I'm about Four. average. So, uh, let me start here. Uh, Lom. Well, I'm a little bit better than average. About a 12. Tidbit. Average. Juice. Seven. 
Wilster. Four. Ophi. Sixteen. She's got her eyes wide open. Okay. I'm more interested in like hanging out and talking right now. Of course. Um, I'm worried about my horses. Your your horse is a little bit slower, but on the mend. That's good. You've been feeding it. You guys got lots of grain actually from the elves. Plus, you have bread goods that you're eating before they become unedible. Yeah. Uh, you guys found some salted meats a while back, which still hasn't gone bad. And you're probably just about finishing up that, that alligator, alley crocod thing. Crocod thing. Yeah. Dinosaur. Yeah. Um, Ophi, as you're looking around, you uh, see, I don't know, it looks like uh, a form standing on the lower part of this hill. It, they might be, they're standing perfectly still. Still. Anything I can make out about them or no? Um, you, they look, no, it's, it's a little too hard to tell. You just see the shape more though, more so than you see anything else. Uh, it looks like a pretty average human height. I want to tug, uh, Ophi's gonna kind of waddle up to Lama and tug at his like his his chainmail sleeve and point at the man. You get off the horse? Yeah. <laughs> sure. Um okay, so do I I follow the direction of her finger and do I see the dude or the person or the whatever? Yeah, you can see the outline or the shape. It's a little bit uh mm, it's a little bit uh, hard to tell from this distance and the angle much about it. It looks really bleak in colors, which is, I don't know, maybe the way it's supposed to be. Okay. Um, I will nudge uh, Juice immediately to my left, like, Juice, see that guy? I I slowly descend to all fours and start stalking my way through the, what little shrubbery there is. So are your... um are you stopping the horses or are you keeping going? I, I would I would probably like motion to like stop. Yeah. 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 Okay. Stop the horses and then if he's gonna get on all fours, I'll kinda of follow behind him. Okay. Slowly creep okay. forward. How quiet can you be? I feel as though I'm super quiet. You have a one but that. probably anybody within a ten mile radius can hear me. Okay. Wilster, what are they doing? I don't know. Um, maybe they saw something. Kofi is going to follow along. I think they're taking a poop break. Um, let's just quietly observe them. Not very quietly. Okay. <laughs> um, the padded thump of Ophi's feet <laughs> are the loudest thing <laughs> pat, pat, behind pat, you. Pat, pat. Uh, as you get closer, go ahead. Well, actually, I'm closest, so I'll move you guys up there. I'll be stepping on <laughs> every branch in her path. <laughs> Probably. Uh, <laughs> Worcester and Tidbit, did you hang back? Is that accurate? Did I hear that? Right? I think they're pooping. Okay. <laughs> well, I don't think they're pooping. Yeah, because uh, the horses are here, so they can't be pooping. But I'm, I'm going to hold on to the horses. <laughs> That's just Keep an eye on. <laughs> You'll hold on to them? Okay. Uh, yeah. I'm still on the back of the horse. Yeah. So as you get close, you it looks like this is um, a statue carved. It's a solid stone figure. You've seen statues before. Um, <coughs> juice, most statues are overgrown, ruins. Mm -hmm. okay. uh, no one's making new ones. This is really a fresh looking, nice statue. Mm -hmm. Nice and clean. Ophi, you know what statues are. You haven't had a chance to see many of the surface world. Right? Um, Man. Do you, are there randomly statues next to roads? I mean, here? statues be in weird places, but never so nice. Look at this thing, man. Well, it's, it, it's all right. It's not fantastic. Oh, come on. It's, it's a weird place. 
Oh, Ophie's looking for, um, she's looking for maker's marks on the statue. Yeah. Like I was evidence whiskey. that it is a statue. Yeah. yeah. Right. Well, so you're investigating how. <laughs> yes, she, she got a 19 on that. Okay. You, <coughs> as you go through, you don't see maker's marks. You do see a couple of deep, like gashes, like someone actually carved wounds into the statue. Like uh, there's a, uh, it looks like a, like a claw mark across the face. It looks like a talon of some sort. And uh, there's a rip in the statue looks female. Um, you're that familiar enough with humans to know the difference. Uh, and it looks like there's a, a rip through that also caused some sort of tear in the, the leg material of the statue. So it's like a statue memorializing, memor memorializing combat, maybe something. I'm going to sit there and just walk up to it and just kind of like, hey, you see how good this statue is? And I kind of like, just like feel how sturdy it okay. is. So you have to slosh off the road a little bit. It's a little bit, just a little murky down yeah. there. Not a big deal. Yeah. Okay. I'll just walk up to it and just kind of just like admiring the, the craftsmanship. Okay. I haven't ever seen, I haven't got to see one so nice before. Oh, he's obviously down there. She's give it a couple it. pokes with my staff. Lom is kind of looking around, looking for like ruins. Because I mean, if there's a statue, then there was probably some sort of like a like a pedestal that it was on, or you know, maybe there was like a path or a garden around it. And mm -hmm. So he doesn't really understand why there would be a statue here. That's yeah, Frank kind of Wilster's going to start leading the horses down the path toward them. Yeah, I'll, I'll okay. call out and be like, <laughs> guys, there's there's a statue. There's there's a statue here. Oh wait, I have to be quiet. Guys, there's a statue. <laughs> I'm gonna give him a thumbs up. I okay. can see it. Oh, they're they're pooping on, on statues. Oh yeah. No, they're not <laughs> pooping. Get your head out of the toilet. <laughs> What's okay, a toilet? It's on Lom's shirt again and says It's a gnome oh, invention. This is a pretty weird statue. I'm not that familiar with statues, but this is kind of weird. No. Oh no. <laughs> <laughs> Man. The joy of of uh, high lighting. We'll just put them up there as best we can. So yeah, you got, you're up there, Wilster, by now, by the time they've gotten here. And you're just riding on the back tidbit? Yeah. Okay. There's no reason to be anything else. It's nice not to have to walk. Huh. Okay. Um, the statue doesn't look like anyone we might have heard of or seen. Um, it reminds you a bit of, uh, it, it certainly maybe make a investigation for me, please. It's so hard not to sing when I hear that. 13. Damn. 13. Um, it's it just it really looks familiar. It's not coming to your mind. Is it uh, an elf? Uh, no, no, it's a human. But it, okay. it really, it's just, it's like you should know. It's on the tip of your thoughts. And um, Lom and Ophi, uh, behind you, you hear a little bit of a splash, and you see. It looks like. Two overly large chickens. Do Wilster and I see that? No. Nope. Nope. Just you guys. They're they're sort of milling about, and they look up at you, and they just have this huge roll initiative. Oh. Like for all. I also need D and D Beyond for the chickens. <laughs> They're definitely chickens. Totally. That's yeah. Big. Yeah, the gnomish chickens very right. dangerous. They're gnomish sized chickens. Alfie, we can eat those. Can we? It doesn't have a face like me. It's got me. 
<laughs> Wolfie's a mushroom vegetarian. <clears throat> I mean, they're still using the meat right now, but when they're not, sure, we eat them. Yeah. You don't eat them while they're alive. No, no, that's just that's just okay. Rude. That would be rude. They will yeah. still be using their meat. Mom. Not when they're not live. Yes. When they're unlive, then they're no use Tidbit. no more. 19. <laughs> Juice. 16. What was that? 16. Thank you. Wilster. 13. Okay. Ophi. 4. Okay. So, uh, Tidbit, you hear a large screech, which directs your attention somewhere, um, but you can't really, you don't immediately see where it's coming from. It takes you a moment to, to see that. How are the horses reacting? Um, they're quite startled from the sound. Uh, they might run. I, well, I'm holding one. I'm well, on no, one. I'm holding both. I'm holding their reins. Well, I'm on one. Yes. But I'm, I'm obviously holding, holding on to something. <laughs> yes. And I'm holding, right. So um, I actually would like to calm the horse. Okay, please try to handle it. Yeah. Eight. Eight, all right. Well, um, it doesn't seem like you're gonna have a lot of success with handling them. He's backing up, starting to trot back, and... Uh, I will get off the horse? You would have to, at this point, jump off the horse to get off. Okay. Okay. Athletics, please. Acrobatics, right? Nope. Athletics, please. Nine. Nine. Okay. Uh, it doesn't clear the area of the horse, so you're, like, right under it. Okay. Now uh, uh, I need you to be some acrobatic-type stuff. Eight. Oh, okay. You are dancing under the dancing horse. Beautiful. Uh, Juice, you were examining the statue, mm -hmm. and uh, you hear this screech, and you are you see already that Lom and Ophi have turned towards it, and you see these giant chickens. Um, uh, I would sit there and sling up my my uh, light crossbow. And I'd yell at it, Yo, get out of here, crazy bud! Get out of here! And try to just scare it away. All right. Uh, 23. Okay. It looks really fired up. It looks even angrier for that. And uh, it seems like this is a really volatile chicken. Oh, my. <clears throat> oh. Uh, Wilster. Um, you I'm going to try to keep my horses from running away. Okay, I need some uh, strength involved. Strength? Yeah, make a save. I crawl. Stupid chicken stick in my... Eight. Okay, so the one that uh, Tidbit was on just yanks right out of your hand as, he, as it's dancing all over Tidbit. Uh, the other one, um, do you want to try to calm it down or just physically restrain it? Now I want to calm it down. Yeah. Like a good druid. Uh-huh. Go for it. Uh, that would be a nine. Okay. Um, doesn't seem to be too calming. Apparently, this chicken is really frightening. What the hell kind of chickens are these? I don't know. The horses seem to have an idea. Right. So, Lom. Well, um, you can hear the horses neighing a little bit. <coughs> All right, that I don't I don't understand that, but uh, I'm gonna pull out my uh, I'm gonna pull out my longbow and reprimand Juice. Right, Juice, don't why are you trying to scare away dinner? Have you never, do you not normally have chickens here? And uh, I want to wing an arrow at the nearest chicken because dinner. Uh. How about a 15? A 15? Absolutely. Um, just right under the wing of this chicken. 
Uh, seven damage? Seven. Okay. Let's see here. Yep. Um, it screeches, like, super loudly. Like, ah! uh, so, you immediately, what you know of chickens thinks that that's not right. <laughs> you, uh, you've been around chickens in markets, and you've watched people take their heads off and wring their neck, dress them up really easily, but no chicken has ever survived Yeah, that. there's a lot of weird shit down here, though. I think that's probably just, like, chickens, how chickens are here, man. Eh, the trees are weird here. The chickens are probably weird here. That's just how it is. Uh, Mom's not the brightest. Ophi. He, he may well believe it's a chicken. Huh. Um... <clears throat> Ophi has, um, she, she is, she's not been in the world for very long, but she has, um, she has, she has read countless books and encyclopedias and different, uh, tomes of knowledge about just the world and the creatures living in it. Has she ever seen a chicken that looks like that in any of her books? Historically speaking. Um, she has a sheet. Uh, say eighteen. Uh, so, uh, no, definitely not a chicken. You think it's some sort of horrible creature <coughs> that is not actually a chicken. Uh, you think you've heard of these um, creatures that are some sort of mutation that are super aggressive and attack people. That's all you really remember from that book. But they were. They looked like big chickens. This would fit the bill for what those might be. Lom, I don't think that's a chicken. Well, I, I do, what is it then? It oh. looks like a chicken. Would this be it something? It sounds like a chicken. It's not a chicken. But Maybe it's a chicken. But, okay. No, trust me. I read about it in a book. <laughs> It, does that mean it's a friend? I, I think it might be whatever the opposite of a friend is. A not a friend. A not a friend. Yes. Yes. There's a lot of notas for you. There's not a dragons, not a friends. Mm. Not a food. It's not a, a criminal food. scum. Is, is this something familiar to Juicer Wister? Well, uh, you don't know because uh, you they are coming at you. Well, oh. they're coming at Lom and Lom. <laughs> Does Ophi still have time for an me. action? Damn it. Uh, yeah. What's your action, Ophi? Um, she is going to reach into her sleeve and she is going to, um, in, in the direction of the chicken, she is going to throw her little puff of smoke. And... Uh... Does not seem phased. Damn. Uh, and then the not a chicken comes up and bites at you, Lom. That's very unchicken like. Uh, totally. It's a fifth. There's a. Uh, I don't. I, I was started late, so actually, I, what I should ask is, Lom, what's your AC? Let me go around here real quick. I should ask this originally. 16. 16. And tidbit. What's your AC? Uh, currently at 17. Juice. Currently 11. Wilster. I'm rocking the 14. Ophi. She, wait, which, what am I saving? AC. AC. I just need to know the number. Uh, no, that's not good. Uh, 12. <laughs> 12, okay. Uh, so long this first uh, chicken bite just pings off your armor. And the second chicken bite uh, does similar things. And they are batting their ling wings. Now they've gotten close. You actually see that it's almost got a reptilian scale on its body. Yeah. Some sort of, uh, I don't know, it's, it's definitely not a chicken now. Now you know it's some sort of reptile chicken hybrid? I'm I think sure. it's a reptar. <laughs> uh, Rep rep chicken. I don't rep chicken. Tidbit. Um well I still haven't seen what's going on, but I've heard quite a bit, so I'm gonna step forward um on the top of the mountains, just straight forward. Okay. 
I you believe can... that uh, Wilster can handle the horses by himself. Okay. So um, you need to dexterously save to get out from underneath this okay. stamping animal. Uh, 15. Okay. So you're able to roll out. It's <laughs> difficult terrain. Yeah. You do that. She totally rolls right down the hill. Uh, my poor horses. <laughs> really? You just let, let go and roll down the hill? Yeah. Cut okay. a barrel roll. Barrel, yeah, barrel roll right into the chicken. Heck yeah. <coughs> I'll allow it. Thank you. <laughs> that sounds awesome. <laughs> I will let you barrel roll into the chicken. <laughs> I need you to. Uh, uh, you're both going to get the damage. <laughs> yes, awesome. Make, uh, yeah, go ahead and. and uh, Six? It's just an unarmed attack oh well, otherwise it's just, just you okay i think i'll allow it might be my favorite words to hear from a dm yes seven yeah. seven so uh you you barrel into it and it sort of jumps over you and goes Aah! uh <laughs> you uh do not get a, to do a massive amount of damage to it That's you do it. take a point of damage and okay. bruises and cuts as you it's still awesome. down there i'm excited uh, so you did it. You actually did the barrel roll. Juice. You'll get away from friends, you crazy bud. And I sit there and I'm going to rip a bolt. You're going to run it. up there and rip them? Um, no, I got a, uh, the light crossbow. Ah, okay. So if I, if I need to like move side to side to get a clear shot. No, you're okay because Tidbit is actually on the ground under the chicken. Okay. The chicken's pretty tall I'm, compared I'm gonna, to I'm gonna probably I'm going to shoot at the one that I see an arrow sticking out of. All right. Uh, I, yeah, like double. All right. Um, powerful strike against the arrow chicken. Yeah. So that's thirteen. Yes. You, you do, uh, a mighty blow and it turns its eyes on you and they just look furious like it starts frothing almost it's angry with an arrow stick a bolt sticking yeah out of its, neck. it's got I'm a like, bolt what? sticking out of its neck it's got a gash from a great sword right no i mean from a, a, a longbow a longbow and that so it's got two arrows in it well a bolt and an arrow what kind of bud uh <laughs> does that inspire you to run uh <laughs> i'm mm, i'm i'm gonna hold stud i'm gonna hold steadfast at this moment Okay. Wilster. What are my horses doing? Well, one of them is backing up. He was, uh, because of Tidbit uh, jumping off and he was dancing around, he yanked himself out of the hand. The other one is also backing up, but dragging you with him. You're still holding on to that one. Yeah. But I'd these like to damn say, chickens. It wasn't actually my fault. He was startled before by the cry of, of the chicken. Yes. Yeah, yeah. Oh, yeah. It but was... then he yanked out of the hand. Yeah. Mm -hmm. What kind of world is this that chickens are scaring us and we're not scaring the chickens? Hmm. I can't. We can't lose the, the horses. This world, man. Okay, yeah. I'm gonna. I'm gonna sprinkle a little sand while I tell them to take it easy, and we'll be back to them in a minute. <laughs> this is the upside. Okay. Down. Uh, how much sand do you sprinkle? Twenty. Twenty sand. All right. Say sleep. I'll be back. All right. So these are not okay. So the one that was out of your hand uh, and was a little bit injured, the most scared, just sort of lays down, and goes to sleep. Excellent. And his friend? No. Nope. The one less calm? He's, he's, uh, he, you have his reins, but he is not sleeping. He's snorting and still yanking you, trying to yank you along with him. Excellent. And then I'm going to reach into my pouch and grab a couple of rocks as a bonus action. All right. And then that's me. Okay. Let's see here. So reach into your pouch. Let's find out. Next time on. Okay. We're all good. Lom. 
All right. Um, Halflings are lucky. I've ever seen a chicken be shot twice and not go down. So Slom thinks something's up. He's going to drop the bow and grab the sword and swing it at this chicken. And uh, he's going to connect. And deal seven more points of damage to the already wounded not a chicken. All right. It's not a chicken head flies off. With one last squawk. About damn time. These things are a lot hardier than chickens. I don't think they're chickens. They're definitely not fucking chickens. Also, what's a chicken? We'll, we'll talk about it later. All right. Ophi. Um, Ophi, uh, Ophi uh, roots around in her backpack for, or for her a little light crossbow, and she shakily puts a bolt in and wind, cranks it up, and you go and dealing. Oh shit, I should have had this prepared. <laughs> <laughs> Just hold it nice and steady. Oh, uh, she deals uh, dealing three points of damage to the not a chicken. <laughs> the not a chicken looks incest. Angry. Thank you for not shooting me. <laughs> Uh, and so, Lom, you get to attack it as the knotted chicken goes around you and jumps onto Ophi. Do I get to as well? Yes, you do. Does a 15 connect? It does. Okay. I hit him for 12 points myself. And 8 points myself, and I hit. Okay. Just a quarter half to the, like, knee... The not a chicken still arrives in front of Ohi. Bless you. And uh, speaks, just gets a massive beak, rips through some of your robes, pulls into your flesh a little bit. Dick, man. Uh, yeah, that's it's a horribly violent. Um, Ophi um, is not yelling, but like kicking furiously. Does Five piercing damage and make a constitution save for me, please. Oh, oh crap. Um, uh, that will be a uh, 11. 11, okay. You, you, on the area where the beak went through, you actually see sort of spreading out from it almost that scaly look that's on his skin. It just immediately starts to spread out around the wound and stiffen you up a little bit. Tidbit. Have I seen this before? Make, uh, um, it's a V at nine. I don't no, think I've seen you have it before. not heard of these crazy things. Yeah, so I will stand up and walk towards it. Okay. And whack it with my stick. And they hit. Wow. Oh, wow. It's weirdly sticky. Nine. Okay. So this and then falls face first stops flapping on the ground. Ophie, make another constitution saving throw. <laughs> oh no. Oh. Oh. Oh, that was the wrong die. Where did my <laughs> yeah. die go? I was like, wait a minute. I thought I had more size than that. Uh, 11 again. Okay. Ophi stops moving entirely and goes gray wait, like stone. Wait. Her clothes look gray? Her clothes look gray as well. And it reminds you awfully of this human here beside you. Are we still around? Uh, not anymore. We're not. And... You just, the world kind of closes in around you and goes black. I approach her and... I, Ophi feels like a statue. I, I'm, She's hard. I'm going to like walk up to her and 
Ofi. Ofi, get up. Come on. Um, I like, well, shit. I like shake, try to like shake her away. Statues in this place are way more tragic than they are where I'm from. Please be on the lookout. Look out for what? What what are we looking out oh, for? Oh crap, she's got a magic. She's got a magic. And it cure her for 10? Wait, isn't magic bad? Um nothing happens. I've, that didn't work. Well, nothing happens to Ofi. Yeah. I tried to heal her. I'm I'm going to just kind of like pick her up. Like, Ophie, come on, and just start shaking a little bit. Make more. a strength check. <laughs> <clears throat> Oof. No. Actually, like even that. as you, so you already know it's probably over the weight you can lift. And then as you, yeah, you almost knock Ophie over with that. And poop your pants. Yeah. I Ophie's heavy as a stone. I might have pooped my pants a little bit with that one. Yeah. Just yeah. a little juice. Yeah, just a little juice. <laughs> 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 what were you all thinking? What did you let those things anywhere near? Uh, all right, well, I'm going to pick up the... Mom's going to pick up a dead chicken. Like, Here, let, let, let's try this. And, like, rub the chicken <laughs> on her. Does this work? I, but for not a chicken? Like, oh. I'm, I'm this is the first chance I've had to look at these chickens, Frank. Do I know what they are? Oh, it is the first chance you've had. Um, what, arcana or uh, nature? What, what, what does your arcana say? Uh, my arcana says Your natural 18. instincts say no way, but your arcanic instinct says this is some sort of monstrosity type Son of a creature. bitch, this thing turned her to stone. I'm right behind you, guys, because you're all actually up here. Or around Opie. You tried to lift her up. You know, next time, if it's not a chicken, don't say it's a chicken. We we don't know what it was. We thought it was. They thought How it was. About I don't know what it is. Can we ever do anything right for you, Wilster? I'm just saying. Yeah, seriously. I Stick in the mud. I I'm gonna go to a uh, tidbit and, uh, and she's a stone in the road. No, not not uh, not tidbit. No, he's calling me a stick in the mud, but now if he's a stone in the road. Oh, yeah, that is true. Did it ever occur to you to run away? What? From a bird? You don't know what you're fighting. It looks Why like would a you chicken. fight it? it? It's just a crazy little bird. We thought it would just go away if we scared it, but then it started oh, yeah. coming, so we shoot at okay, it. Okay, I'll tell you what, what. If you'll make a list of everything that will turn us to stone. We'll let you know when we run into it. This, well, is that, here's a here, that here's works? a list of everything that might turn you to stone. Everything not here, everything not us, might turn you to stone. What What about that tree over there? Will that turn me uh, to stone? Maybe, maybe. Thank what you. about that tree next? To, I'm just gonna like one by one. What about that? What about that? I'll tell you what. Why don't you go touch them and you let me know if one of them turns you to stone. <laughs> <laughs> I I'm I'm getting a little bit frantic and I go to tidbit and and like shake her. I say, hey, you do you do heal stuff. You make people better, make them better. I and I wanted to talk to Wilster and I say, Wilster, if yes. if you're always running, how do you live your life? Well, not as a statue. I didn't say you always run. When you know what you're up against, that's different. And juice, I already tried to heal her. She's like two feet tall. We've got two six-foot guys with swords longer than they are. I'd like to pluck some feathers. Okay. When you go to pole, you notice they're, they're almost like scale-like. They're not like normal feathers. They're, they're really raggedy on top, but you can get some. Yeah, I get some. I put yep. them in my pouch. Um, can I... Um... So behind you, you guys all hear a breath, like a loud... <laughs> Okay, I turned to face it. Sword yeah, me hand. too. Okay. Well, not with a sword in hand. <laughs> I turned to face it. <laughs> uh, this human uh, collapses to the ground, not a statue. Okay, I want to run over okay. to him and shake him. What to did her. you do? How, why are you not a statue anymore? <laughs> So what, what's Tidbit doing? You're going to go over and check her out? Yeah. Okay. 
Um, what's Juice going to do? I've I probably snapped around with my crossbow at like you know a sudden like I thought we were alone and then I hear something else start breathing and collapse and what? him talking to somebody like, aim it at whoever it was. What's Wilster going to do? I'm going to stand next to Juice and I'm going to pull my dagger out. Okay, and I know what Ophi's doing. Yeah, <laughs> we all know what Ophi's <laughs> doing. Here's what Ophi's doing. Can you move me over. Eighteen. Next to her? Yeah. It was an eighteen. Okay. Uh, she seems. Per- yeah, could you move tid- tidbit over there as well? So she seems perfectly fine, other than some wounds on her that are uh, that are showing now clearly, as opposed to before when they were just looking like stone indentations. Do they look okay. like grievous wounds, or are they just like meh? Ah, uh, well, tidbit can tell that they're not grievous. Okay. She's breathing. She's breathing, too. She'll recover with time. I assume that something similar might happen to Ophi. So what we got to do? We just sit here and wait? Yeah. Well, why don't you ask her how long she's been a statue? All right. Well, at this point, I'll just grab her, like, basically by the front of her shirt, tunic, whatever. That's not going to help her get better. Kind of set her on her feet. Oh, shit. I brace Stand her. Up. Okay. So she doesn't like, I fall. I don't just drop her. Like, she'll support herself and let it go. I'm just going to try to. She doesn't seem to support herself. She seems she's to be She's going to wake up in an hour. But she, How just, do you know? Because I'm a fucking cleric. <laughs> <laughs> I'm a doctor. <laughs> yes. How many PhDs do you have? Uh-huh. <laughs> Got a PhD kicking your ass. Lay her down nice and gentle. Okay. It'll be okay. We just have to wait around. Protect them. Okay. You I say think. so. I what think. time is it? Mm, it was probably afternoon. Okay. Mid afternoon. Well, I'm going to go sit on the ground and lean back against Ophie. Is, is well, Ophie like, is, she, is, is she's on the ground? Are you laying down? No, she's standing. She's standing? Mm-hmm. Okay. Yeah, I got well, like this little for a while. Tom Sawyer thing going on. Plan on just staying oh, for the night, I guess. Up. Oh no. What? Do what? What time? Just, what time is this all going on? Afternoon. It's probably not even lunchtime. I'm gonna, I'm gonna drop my my sling and start cussing under my breath. Pull out a dagger and some stupid fucking bird. God damn. Fucking stone bird. And I start just cutting into it. And start carving, like, skinning it. Why? Well, start so don't eat it. Make a fire. That is not food meat. Who said anything about eat? It, okay. it doesn't have a face, though. Isn't that the rule here? Yeah. Or something about a chunk of stone. It's definitely the rule we're teaching Ophi. We can't have her waking up and we're eating the wrong thing. <laughs> Juice, you're over there. You're cutting into it. You know, I'm sort of... Make a dexterity saving throw. Uh oh. Uh, twenty one. Oh, okay. Uh, so the head sort of not not of its own accord, but because as you're moving it around and stuff, the head sort of swirls <coughs> around, and the beak, which remains super sharp, just sort of slides along something. And when it does, you see the uh, you kind of get the feeling that uh, had that hit you that it would still affect you. Ooh, totally need to harvest that. I <laughs> I carefully, I'm actually probably going to, what could I, I'm going to take one of the, the, the shirts that I got and wrap it around one of my hands uh, a couple times and then grab a hold of the, the beak kind of towards the base of it and I'm going to sit there and Cut cut it off the face of the bird, and then unwrap the 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 shirt from around my hand to wrap it around the beak itself. Brutal. Okay. Put it on my little lap sack, and then I go back to just cutting this thing in pieces. Okay. <laughs> so you guys make camp here, like a temporary camp. Yeah, yeah. Well, yeah. while he's doing that, I want to go up and start you a fire. Have, you have like a beak of stone. Yeah. So I, awesome. Not that I'm really aware of anything, but is do- did Ophi's hat come off at all? No. Nope. Okay. No, nope, you're a statued on. You're just made of stone. 
at Nala. And I'm lean, I'm just going to sit there, lean back against the statue, and wait till it moves. Okay. Pissed. When I get through pulling the skin off of the 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 bird that I've been working on, I'm going to throw it up in one of the trees. Hey, Wilster, why don't you go get the horses? Bring them down here. They're right there. At the top of the hill. Fine. Please. I'm, I'm would, it, would it help if I said please? No, I don't mind. I'm just pissed. I'm I'm praying. Praying. If you're going to piss, then All right, the horses you get the horses. Place. You're you're praying. What's Over. Long making you're, a fire. You're carrying it out. You're making a fire. I'm, I'm praying over um, the strange lady. The strange lady. Okay. Where do you make this fire, guys? A um, little bit farther towards you. Off-road. Off-road? This yeah. Way? Yeah, there. That works. Okay. And then put the lady close enough to the fire to get some warmth and whatnot. All right. Ooh, hair on my head. I'd be next to the lady. Be next I'm going to tie the horses to Ophi. Inspiration. Virtual high five. That's pretty excellent. Yeah. <laughs> and then I'm just going to take a short rest if I can. Okay. <clears throat> oh, yeah. I want to pick up my longbow. I don't want to leave it standing where I dropped it. Yeah. Okay. Okay, after about an hour. A short rest. Yep, you guys, uh, please roll. You make it the whole hour without anything coming across you in the swamp. Sorry, that was probably loud. I can't hear if it's loud. I have no feedback. Monitors are off today. What are we rolling? Yeah, um, you are well, uh, you're only rolling if you need to use some hit dice. Oh, okay. Oh, oh. No. I thought it was a check. Sorry. That's juice. That's me. Yeah, they lose hit points, not me. I'm from falling from barrel I'm just roll. Tired. <laughs> <laughs> I'm just tired. <laughs> oh, you'll note, by the way, this is, I'm sorry, I got to take us out of it for a moment. I'm looking at you. I'm looking at you. I'm looking at you. I'm looking at you. And you look at them. Look. Yeah. Look. I know. It I did. Works. I've been checking no. it out. <laughs> I've been oh. side eyeing. I can't see it at the same time. <laughs> so I've been side eyes on it. We can actually like look at it. But then if we want to watch Tom, we got to watch Tom. I can find it okay. at this side of the <laughs> Yeah. Hey it actually still works though. Like if everybody, if we look at that, mm -hmm. then we're still Yay. looking at Tom. Sorry. I had to, had to break this moment because. Oh, well done, awesome. Frank. Minor accomplishment. Yeah. I'll that's take it. why we're here. No. I'll take it. That's <laughs> why we were late today. No, no. It is not. Yeah, I just want to. <laughs> yeah, it took me an hour to flip the camera around. <laughs> Ooh. Technology is hard. <clears throat> Sorry. Um, her eyes open up. Hi. Ophis? Nope. Hi. This uh, human. May Osara bless you. All right. She sort of skitters back a little bit and uh, searches around on the ground like she's looking for something in the, in the water. She's looking at you guys pretty scared. So she's over there? or She's right there. So when she backs up, she's like back into me? Yeah, yeah, probably back into you. All right. Well, I'm just kind of grab her, not like hostile, like, whoa, whoa, steady there. It's steady. okay. Ma'am, okay. it's okay. I need you to gentle animal. Gentle? No, she's not an <laughs> animal. <laughs> How about persuade? Yeah, um, eight. And I rolled maybe long is more persuasive. Nat twenty for a twenty-two. Whoa! Whoa. You have the confidence Lady, of a really guard. Need to call me shit. <laughs> <laughs> right now. <laughs> she calms down. She looks around. Are they gone? Are they gone? Gone enough. I think, well, if you look, I kind of point in the tree where one of them skins hanging out. Like, well, there's some of one. <laughs> Dead raptor right chickens. Uh, so she goes, where, where are my, where are my tribe? Where are my people? Oh, shit. That's a good question. They, I don't know. Who are your um, people? Wilson? What tribe? 
the, the, the human tribe, the rock dwellers, oh, yeah. as people who tell, call us. We oh, have, we have, uh, not, how, how many? Maybe they're dwelling in the rocks. They eat my stone eating chicken. There's six of us. Well, what ye. Well, huh. We only found you. Yeah, I'm going to go over there and I'm going to lean into Lom quietly. I'm going to tug on his chain shirt. I'm going to do this so he leans down. Mm-hmm. He leans down. Well, if she was a statue and the chickens were still here, maybe they got eaten by the chickens. Yeah. She's yeah, totally going to hear that. I'm just well, I'm whispering. You're what, right what next to her. What year is it right now? I'm going to ask Wilster. What, what year is it here? It's this year. I don't know what year it is. <laughs> Do I know what year it is, right? It's the year of our You God. have no idea. <laughs> yeah, what year? This year? Oh, this place sucks. Um, I'm just dusting off Ophi. Is there any detritus of any sort that might imply that other people were here and eaten? You can start looking around for it. I'm going to do that. Tidbit, what are you doing? Yeah. Um, um, what moon was it when you came here? We just left the meat. Oh. About a day ago. Yes, about a day ago. Okay. <laughs> uh, wow. But you got she it. doesn't look convinced when, when she says that. <laughs> it might take Ophi a little longer to come back. Like a day. Well, um, I guess... Do you, honestly, do you remember being a statue? No. Okay, well, I you were a statue. by one of these creatures. Yeah, and I'll point at Ophi, see, like, you see that? You yes. looked a lot like that, except you were taller. Not really a statue. That thing turned you into a statue. And now you're not a statue. But I guess it was a, a day ago or something. But I don't know where your people are. Well, we were heading back to the north to our, they were heading back. She looks very strangely at you, Lon. She looks just kind of uh, odd at you in a way that you haven't necessarily seen. Well, no, you you actually probably saw something similar when, when they were standing over you after you fell onto the wagon, <laughs> you were quite an anomaly. And uh, that was a very similar look. It's one of kind of a strange amazement, almost like, wow, what's this thing? She sort of reaches up towards your face. I'll kind of look at her weird, kind of quizzically and reach out towards her face. <laughs> 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 okay, uh, is this what your people do? No, she drops her hand. I'm sorry. I just, you're different than the others. Yes. Yes, I am. Bom, chicka, bom, bom. Do you know about those? I point at, uh, at Juice. <laughs> like, do you know about bugbears? Are those different? Or are those normal here? We've seen bugbears. There's many. But you haven't seen... Well, we've seen half works. So what's weird? I don't get it. You're different. Thank you. I think. So where is your people? How far north do you go? We should have two or three days on the road would have gotten us to there. We were only a day out. Well, we're probably going north if you want to come with us. It's probably safer than traveling alone. <clears throat> she looks a little bit like... Make an insight check. I <laughs> tidbit, you're sitting there too, right next to him, so you may make an insight check as well. 
Six. Unmentionable. <laughs> oh, no. Five. No. Um, she just says, yes, may maybe that's a good idea. Okay, well, we don't know how long you were a statue for, but we're going to wait and see if our friend becomes unstatued like you just did, and then we'll be heading out. Might take up to a day. Okay. All right. So are you guys going to sleep here the night then? Mm-hmm. Yeah. Are there any tracks or anything that's implied oh, that other yeah. people tell left? Me, tell me what your investigation was, because you were looking around. Yeah, I'm oh, looking no for one. signs of other people, so... Uh, 20 natural 20. Wow. Okay. That's good. And now give me, you Very definitely thorough. found a lot of stuff that looks interesting. Uh, now your survival skills need to kick in. But he's probably got giant survival. <laughs> 14. Okay. You definitely can tell that there were people here. There looks like there was some sort of combat here. And then they continued north oh uh, any idea how many um yeah a group you you can't really <laughs> tell that well okay <clears throat> i'll go back up to lom when he's not talking to the lady uh hey yeah lom yeah. it looks like there was a group of people here and they left her do you how do you know that uh, the tracks show them leaving. Oh, okay. Um, do you know how long ago that was? I don't know if I do or not. Huh. <laughs> after, after we decided to make camp here, I would probably take the horses and in time from Ophi in time to a tree. <laughs> so, do we know? Do I know? You haven't asked. No one's asked yeah. for introductions. Uh, do I know how long ago, Frank? Uh, you would say about... 24 hours. I'd say about 24 hours, maybe 23. 24 seems like a big number. Oh. Ma'am, what's your name? Uh, oh, my name. Mm -hmm. I'm Tidbit. Uh, Marigold. Oh, that's a beautiful name. Would you like some bread? I got it from the elves. It's delicious. I would love some. So I hope she'd freak out and say, no, you can't eat elf bread. <laughs> I, I'm going to slide it. <laughs> when I see you handing out, start offering her bread, Juice kind of just snarls. Are you going to shell with lady to get us attacked by buds? If she know here, we would have been gone. Well, she now didn't Ophie really hurt. get us attacked, though. I mean, she was here being all stone-like, and we stopped for her, and now Ophie's stone-like. Don't uh, be a dick. Yeah, yeah. Yeah. He just kicks some dirt at her. <laughs> <laughs> See, um, that's no how mind. a bugbear's supposed to act. Pay no <laughs> mind to him. He's, He's like special. <laughs> <laughs> okay. So, you guys are making camp for the night. What kind of... It's time to tell so. me your watches. Well, all that stuff. Lum, what you doing to prepare this place for evening? And are you going to take one of your watches? Yeah, yeah, I'll take uh, I'll take one of the mid watches that nobody really wants, just because the graveyard it's, shift. Yeah, it's 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 a matter of duty. So yeah, I'll take the last watch. I'll take uh, first watch. I'll kind of want to, you know, any, any branches or you know whatever's on the ground that could get underfoot. You know, if something attacks us, just kind of move everything out, make make us a nice little clearing. Let me you know. take a walk. Second, <laughs> I kind of want to talk to her. But I can wait till tomorrow. Oh. She looks like she's super tired. <laughs> okay. Marigold is going to mostly try to sleep. How many watches do we need? Four. Uh, well, it's up to you guys. Um, you can either take longer ones. Well, no, you're, you're going to be stuck with four. Okay. There's yeah. no wonderful elves in your group. So I'm one. She's two. Uh, uh, Lom's um, three, and then Wilster's four. Yep. Oh, he's on eternal watch. Yeah. Yeah. I'm gonna flick a pebble at Ophie. Does she move? <laughs> nope. Damn it. 
Don't <laughs> damage her. I like Wellster. It's it's a pebble. You can't hurt anything with a pebble. I kind of juice kind of snarls at you, and he kind of like dust off the spot where you threw a pebble at. <laughs> oh, what what do you think happens to our clothes if we break a chunk of clothes off? You- I'm gonna throw a pebble at Juice. <laughs> like, like he just glares at you. <laughs> what what kind come of come pebble come are you me, going bro. to throw at Juice? <laughs> just an everyday pebble. Okay, just an everyday pebble. As your little bitty pebbles couldn't hurt anything. Right. <laughs> just making sure. <laughs> Um, okay. I'm mad at Juice. Juice, you're on this first watch thing, right? Mm-hmm. Yeah, I love him, but I'm nothing mad at him. happens. Fantastic. That you know of. Make a perception check. Uh, nine. No, nothing happens. <coughs> Mom, perception, please. Oh, I think she was. Oh, I'm sorry. You're right. Uh, tidbit. it's tidbit. Uh, six. Okay, nothing happens. Uh, Lom. Eleven. Um, nothing happens. I like that hesitation there. Mm-hmm. Wilster. It's morning. The sun is starting to... Uh, Ah, well, it's no joke. This is when you'd be getting up. The The sun is lighting the sky, but it hasn't, it, it never rises anyway. So it's just barely not deep night anymore, basically. Right. And um, what's your perception? Um, my passive perception? Yes, yeah, sir. 10. Okay. Is your AC the same as it was yesterday? Yeah, it's 14. You are violently yanked from where you are. Uh, You feel all kinds of piercing into your skin. What the hell? You take eight points of piercing damage and you are being pulled away and shaken. By what? Well, it came from behind, so you just know you've been grabbed massively. And I turned my head? It looks like a giant mouth. Oh. I'm going to say, you better put me the hells down or it's not going to be me you're going to have to be dealing with. And he needs to make a DC 13 saving throw. Wisdom. Uh... (laughs) Excuse me. I need to check. Real loud. Real loud. All right. I need everybody else to make constitution saves. Or perception checks. Yeah, why not? I'm sorry, not Ophi. Sorry, Ophi. Oh, well, I just assumed. (laughs) You should do it anyway, Ophi. He's not the boss of you. Yeah. (laughs) You're not the boss. Um, I'll perceive what I want. I perceive what I want. Uh, Let's see. Sorry, guys. I need to look something up. This is one of those strange circumstances. Hmm. What'd you get, uh... Um, Lom? 13. And what did you get, Tidbit? 15. Juice? 17. Okay. And... Ta-da-da-da. Okay. This, uh, thing holds on to you. It is still scared. Everybody wakes up, and you see, dragging Wilster away, a very large crocodile. Oh. Hmm. It, it is scared? It is scared. Uh, it's frightened by you until the end of your turn. Right? Uh-huh. That's correct, right? Yes. Okay. Um, that's what you were going for, I'm assuming. 
Almost definitely. Yeah, I don't want to be its friend. <laughs> so, uh, well, the it it's it feels like its grip is loosening on you, but I'm just telling the others what they see. And everybody, roll initiative for me. Stupid yeah. alligators and <laughs> statues. Almost yeah, everybody roll initiative. Okay. You can roll initiative too, Opie. Okay. Can't in tell me what to do. Uh, oh, look at what a matter. Lum. <laughs> well, okay. Um, oh. I'm rolling initiative like oh, a rock. Yeah. <laughs> Juice. Uh, 11. Uh, Wilster. 11. <laughs> uh, Opie. It was a one, babe. Oh, boy. Yeah. <laughs> it was a one. Exciting. I'll tell you what we're going to do. Uh, we're going to start with Lom after we take a short break. We'll try to keep it like Ooh, 10 minutes drama. or so. Or less. I love it. Um, 10 minutes or less is what our goal is. Okay. If you could give us a break screen there, uh, Heath, so that no one knows how exhausted I look. <laughs> hey, thanks for waiting. <sighs> We are back and we're ready for some crocodile carnage. Did I just say that? I, I wish I did. Wish, yeah. I wish Steve Irwin was here. That's a little cheap. Oh, come on. That's too soon. No, nah, actually, the thing is, it wouldn't be a fight. It would be a peaceful. I know. He would like just talk them down. Croc encounter. You know what? In his honor, I'm going to talk these crocodiles down. <clears throat> <laughs> uh, wait a minute. We are missing somebody. Yeah. Uh, yeah. Tom, get back here. <laughs> get over here, Tom. <laughs> Tom? Oops. <laughs> <clears throat> Sorry, I can't see Tom. He's coming. He's coming. I can he hear did. doors. Lest he die. <clears throat> I don't want to... Um, can't start without Tom. No, you cannot. But we can say hello to everybody and say, look, now we can say hi. 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 Am I How is having everyone? nice dreams as a rock? Roll Probably. a d20. <laughs> Are you prone to good dreams or nightmares? I think yes. <laughs> yeah. okay. uh, uh, I got 15 on dreams. Oh, that, that, I think that sounds like good dreams. Okay. By the way, there's Friendship. only one thing. Uh, I'm just, I guess I got to say it. There's only one thing in the entire array of all the initiatives you rolled that's not an 11, and that's long. With a 12. No, she rolled a 1. <laughs> well, the, I'm sorry. It looks a lot like an, a part of an 11 on here. Oh. <laughs> Half 11. Tom, I'm sorry. We started back without you. But we didn't start. We you just turned the stream you. on. Yeah. We can't hear you yet. Now we can. All right. So I want to pick up Wilster's body <laughs> and carry it away oh. from... I started throwing it's, pebbles at him. Oh, uh, Tom, we started streaming, but we didn't start playing. I'm not gonna it's only been yet. nine minutes. Oh, mm -hmm. we're, we're online, time. but we're back. Um, okay. Uh, yeah, th but uh, what I was saying was the truth, actually. Lom, it is your turn. Oh. Okay. Um, I want to grab my greatsword and jump forward towards the, uh, the thing that's got Wilster in its mouth. And I want to stab downward. Uh, what about a 12? Yeah, I mean, that's that's sufficiently stabby. Oh, you stab it was all good, man. That's uh, seven points of damage. All right. I was trying to pin it to the ground, but I don't think that's sufficient. To make no, it. but I'll tell you what. Um, you don't know if it was you. It seemed like it might have already been starting to release, like maybe Wilster tastes bad. But definitely after you hit it now, the crocodile's mouth opens a bit. And Wilster... <laughs> is not being drugged that direction anymore. But when you do, you also notice a little <laughs> right over here. There's another crocodile. There's two. Um, good job. Uh, and they rush in. Well, one of them rushes at you. You may swing at that one as he rushes away. I would love to swing at that one as he rushes away. And uh, Yeah, stab it good, stab it good. It's the same thing. Or eight points of damage this time. Okay. You, uh, Wilster, may also, I think, you're conscious, right? I am conscious. Okay. You may also 
bad at it or swing or have a weapon in yeah, your I hand. Mean, I have no weapons ready. Ah, okay. Well, the best you could do is punch at it, which I don't know if you want to do or not. I do. I'm pissed. Do it. Yeah. Punch you with, it. Punch you with your teeth. little hands. What was that, Will? Wilson? I said I'm pissed. Oh, I mean. Mm-hmm. Uh, 13? Yeah, absolutely. <laughs> you got a nice solid whack at it. For no damage. Well, that means one. <laughs> <laughs> its little head goes, well, its big head. Its head is like just about the size of your body, really close to it. Um, and this one that runs up on you, Lom, he runs right at you and takes this bite. You see his jaws open up and he just scratches against some of that metallic armor and can't get through it. Tidbit. I'm totally going to jump this crocodile and restrain it. Grapple it. Grapple the crocodile. Yes. Close that mouth so it doesn't damage anyone. So you realize as you go to grab on it that it's, I think it's too big for you to actually hold down. (laughs) (laughs) You're riding it pretty much. (laughs) Great. Yeah. Okay. All right. And juice. Um, I'm going to whip out my my light crossbow and I'm going to pop a shot at the the one that <laughs> Tidbit's riding on. I was like, "Yeah, you ride it. You ride it good." Yeehaw, juice. Uh, how about? I think that's seventeen and nine. All right. Now that that uh, crocodile had not been injured yet, but it's injured now. Oh yeah, that was shooting good. All uh, right, Wilster. <clears throat> yes. What would you like to do? I would like to get away from the damn crocodiles. Okay, Ophi seems like a safe spot. <laughs> yes, I'm gonna go hide behind Ophi. <clears throat> <clears throat> Ophi's holding the horses. <laughs> Ophi can be a, a safe spot and hold the horses at the same time. She might be one of the most useful people in this farm. <laughs> um, Did Marigold yeah. wake up? Nope. Oh, she's sleeping like Ophi. <laughs> <laughs> it must be tiring being a rock. Ophi, were they good dreams? Are they good dreams? Oh, do you want me to see if they're still good dudes? Oh, there goes mine. Whatever, that's fine. Um, yeah, they're it's just still good dreams. She's what are about how she's gonna hold hands with everybody and make <laughs> friends, and she's gonna get some good snacks for a bit of fat, and, <laughs> and everybody's gonna be happy. <laughs> Great, and a little bit of blood splatters on you from from far away. Oh. <laughs> Mom, <laughs> shit, hope he's a Um, all right, I want to try and uh, I want to try and ram this great sword right down that big open maw. In front of me. And, uh, yeah, that should do it. Uh, not super damaging, though. Get him for six points. All right. Yeah, you got a nice chunk in there, but he's still flailing around and quite angry. Uh, in fact, he pulls the sword out of his mouth, backs his head back, and sort of launches at you to grab at you. Uh, and, um, he gets a hold of you at the waist. Whoa. Um, the, the, uh, you give the scale or the chain. I don't know if you put the scale on the chain. Okay. Yeah. It's sort of just, it's crushes down through, gets through some of the links, piercing damage for 11 points. And, uh, Whoa. And you are kind of stuck in its mouth. You still have your sword hand out, of course. And it starts to pull away with you in it and Oaf and uh, Tidbit on top of it. As um, we go down, we go down together. 
Can, can we not do that instead? Can when we it, instead not do when that? When it pulls close to the other crocodile, the other one snaps out at you. Also hitting you along. Five points of piercing damage. Lom is unconscious. Except that. Tidbit. You are on top of Lom. Almost. Lom has, <laughs> Lom has suddenly stopped flailing around as his crocodiles sort of start fighting over his body. And uh, it's your turn, Tidbit. Kind of. Okay. Um, <laughs> I feel this is dire circumstances. Pretty dire. Yeah. See, I am on top. If I like jump to the side, you'll be you'll be okay. They're pretty <clears throat> low to the ground, so you can kind of okay. get off. And and their focus, I mean, they are. It's starting to get tumultuous. They might even start to roll okay. with Lom and try to tear off a nice chunk of them. Fire in the hole! She yells out, no. and no, she no, go yell out. <laughs> and she. In his mouth. Yeah. Says. Thunderous. Boom. And as she booms, the thunder cracks. And she hits both of them. Or does she? Yeah, you hit both of them. Well. Oh, shit balls. <clears throat> <laughs> I'm sorry, I don't have the sheets here. What do they need to save? Uh, 12, con. Okay. For three points of damage, <laughs> but, but um, they are moved 10 feet back. Yeah, two dead crocodile corpses fly back. <laughs> They're both oh, I, I dead. did it. And that was a loud, everybody within 300 feet, that was her <coughs> dramatically massive boom. It sounded like lightning struck the ground. Did we have a long rest before this? Yes, everybody okay. has had so a long rest. So now did Marigold wake up? That's a good question. That was a pretty loud boom. How about Ophi? Nope. <laughs> nope. <laughs> did Ophi <Ophie, laughs> get, get, get a long rest? Uh, no. <laughs> no, being a rock isn't very restful, I imagine. <laughs> <laughs> what did it sound like? It, it sounded like a little pop. pop. <laughs> no, no, no. She finished the mug of beer and slammed it down on the table. Yeah. <laughs> you, you are holding hands with lightning. <gasps> That's a mess. <laughs> I pull out my shield. Um, and I'm looking for gobbler Uh You guys don't see any of those things. I've yeah, but we're I'm. Still pretty shook. Oh yeah, and I'm I've I'm I've already cocked another bolt, and I'm staying real. Vi I probably would have gone up to the hill. To try to get a little bit more view to look for. Uh, after hearing that loud thing okay. and what was obviously like a booming of magic. Oh yeah. So um, all right. So long, uh, long. I know what you're doing. You're recovering. You're breathing. That's right. Oh. You help him up? All right. Yeah. Um, Wilster, what are you doing? I'm panting very heavily. Okay. <clears throat> yeah. All uh, right. So after about 10 minutes, you realize nothing was attracted. Okay. I would, I would, I will drop my, my, my uh, crossbow down and let it hang by its sling and, I'd uh, run down to uh, Wilster is probably closest to me. I'll run down to Wilster. Wilster, Wilster, you okay? You all no, right, I'm buddy? okay. Let me see. Let me see you hearts. I'm, I'm bleeding to death. Pick one. There's like 200. <laughs> <laughs> I, 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 I reach in my backpack and try to pull out a little bit of bandages and try to sure. bandage Are you up. proficient with medicine? That's a good I am. <laughs> oh well, I am not proficient. Okay. If, yeah, I was like, give give me that. We'll still make a check. No, four. <laughs> I'm very frustrated. Uh, I'm gonna do the same. Pull out my bandages for Lom. All right. <laughs> Five. 
Okay. Well, you guys you give me that sufficiently. <laughs> are you proficient with medicine? No, but I got an eighteen. <laughs> All right. So you're able to bend just yourself up much prettier than they could have. But that's it. <laughs> you know, you're not going to bleed to death. We gotta. We gotta. I don't know. Little one still made stone. Wild. Teeth monsters coming. I don't know what to do. I'm going to go harvest some alligator teeth. What you want teeth for? Why wouldn't you? I don't know. You can't eat them. Special potions? Oh. Yeah. Okay, okay. I can make crocodilio. <laughs> <laughs> well, I'll, uh, I, guess I'll, I'll guess I'll go over and pull out a dagger and start carving up a little bit more meat. Yeah, you guys Try have. To, I'll probably would throw out the old alligator meat. This is the best you guys have eaten. By the way, Wilster, Juice. Right. The best you've eaten <laughs> in a long meat. time. Oh, well, yeah, also. And Tid did as well. Yeah, because normally we just try to avoid these confrontations altogether, even if it <laughs> a little bit of food, because I'm not trying to get hurt, man. No. I eat mushrooms. You eat mushrooms? Mm -hmm. <laughs> that's, that's, I've harvested mushrooms and apples. It's all vegetables and fruits. That sounds cool. Mushrooms have the most protein. Good thing. Um, I ate some mushrooms once. Made me see smells. <sighs> what? <laughs> <laughs> I, I think something was lost in translation there. <laughs> One time I ate some mushrooms and I was able to see smells. No, the s snails. They're Sm called snails. Smells. You <laughs> know, normally you smell things with your nose, but I could see the smells. He's hallucinating. Who? No, no, he's juice. <laughs> <laughs> Hallucinations? They're like, well, forget it. Who's hallucination? <laughs> <laughs> uh, so, um, Marigold wakes up, <laughs> stretches. Ah, it's very relaxed and <laughs> relieved healthy good well rested and um she goes what's happened here well you you were asleep for a while again and you missed some things oh. i point out like the uh the gutted gators that's <laughs> been chopped up like see it was those this time nice. wow well they'll make good food are you roasting them like over the fire or cooking any of them? Yeah, sure. I like that idea. Okay. Can I take a short rest? Um, yeah. <laughs> and recover? Uh, uh, you can take a short rest while they're all doing morning preparations and such. Hit I plus. Do you add your con modifier to that? Yes, you do. Um, are you going to take a short rest as well? Oh, absolutely. Okay. Oh, Everybody shit. else will do the cooking. Yeah, I'll take over the cooking. Everybody know juice make best gator. Oops. Yeah, I've opened my satchel and I have like <laughs> as many herbs as what you do can you, have. What do you do with them? Make it extra special. You can make this meat better? I can. No way. 15. Oh, yeah. Oh, that's, the wrong that's a nice so, rub. So she's sitting there like just like sprinkling it down her <laughs> Like sulfate. <laughs> <laughs> I go for the massage. Oh, it in. This is some this is some hard meat. Yeah. It's like elbowing. Tough. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Showing you how strong I am. Man, I didn't know Tippy has such good muscles. <laughs> I told you last time. Well, you just so little. I didn't know. I know. I I so I start cooking the the meat and while she's like finished preparing it. Marigold will help um, gather up some wood and keep the fire going. She seems responsible, just well slept. <laughs> she also seems uh, much healthier than she was yesterday. Marigold, are you heading off by yourself or are you going to wait for us? I'll wait for you. It's not great to be going out by myself. So I've heard. <laughs> what was you and your people's headed to when y'all got stone attacked by the them them bud crazy things? Whenever we go to finders, we go we go and visit uh, some a place where we stay sometimes. Just a little side stop on your way home. It's in the mountain. Yeah. 
What's what's going on there? I don't know. We haven't been there for years or a year. Okay, okay. Here, tell me what you think of this. And I like cut off a small piece of the alligator, <laughs> and, like a little, just a bite, and hand it to her. Okay. She grabs it and eats it. Do you feel sick? <laughs> 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 Inspiration. I um, already have it. Uh, it's too bad. Uh, she says, "No, I don't. I, this is very good. It's incredible. I, what what a great job cooking, and what a great job seasoning." I I kind of just look at Tim. Oh, okay. Try some. <laughs> try some juice. I, I cut off another piece. I try it, and uh, it's delicious. <laughs> <laughs> I'm like, Lom, Lom, you got to try this. This is getting better even than last time. Wait, add some okay. bread to it? It's even better. Oh, we I just seasoned it for the bread. Did we just invent alligator no. pull oh, I think you did. <laughs> Holy <laughs> shit. <laughs> I mean, it's, it's just a sandwich. <laughs> yeah, I like go to town. You guys do have boys. sandwiches here. Oh, I mean, we never had Gator Po' Boy before. <laughs> you, you need a different name. <laughs> it's, it's Sandwich. I'll call it, uh, I don't know, we'll work on that later. <laughs> we'll Rick call it. Sandwich. <laughs> Maybe the chat has some suggestions. Yeah, right? Yeah, what should this be? Uh, yeah, I started out handing out the, the meat. I sit there. And the bread? Yeah, the, the meat and the bread. And like, I make llama sandwich. I make Wilster sandwich i make ofi sandwich and go set it on her, on her feet. Um, i feed the horses a little bit of bread or grains i guess we have some grains for them they still have some grains okay. the elves suited you up with some grains for them as well they're not well actually they're really good compared to what the horses actually eat so yeah they're not complaining it's 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 not what we'd feed them today but. right yeah can you put us by the fire frank of course Thank you. So if you want to stand me up, actually leave me right where I'm at. Just stand. I'm going to kind of do a exercise. I mean, you got to keep in shape. Swing the sword around, kind of get the feel for it. Okay. Wait, um, Tidbit's going to watch <laughs> and emulate what he does. <laughs> but like, <laughs> like behind. Wilster. And quietly. Wilster. Yes. What are they doing? I, I don't know what anybody's doing anymore, Juice. Ugh. Every time I think I get to know them, they start acting all crazy. Every step north we take, things get shittier. That's Ugh. what I know. This has been a crazy couple of days, that's for sure. What do you... I was going to position what you, myself. What do you desire? Where do you want to be? Behind Long, but not too close. Bring Lom over. No, Lom's practicing. Lom's practicing is he's working out with a sword. He's swinging a great sword around in practice. Yeah, don't swing that at me. I mean, that's why I walked away. Okay. Why Lom walked away. Excellent. So we're just waiting for Ovi? I think so. Yeah. How, how are I'm, you guys going to pass the day? I'm going to sleep. <laughs> I'm going to look for herbs. <clears throat> herbs. Herbs. Um, I'm a little bit intrigued in the uh, in this herb this herb game. I've never like tried to like season food before. This is a new concept, uh, and I'm going to tag along with Tidbit. Great. Uh, both of you guys make survival checks. Uh, Twenty one. Twenty one. Wow. So. Uh, so I go along and pick something that looks good, and I show it to him. I'm like, "What's this?" Oh man, we call that uh, stank toe. You think it? <laughs> it doesn't smell too good. Yeah, that's why we call it stank toe. <laughs> okay, I'll put some there. Cause she she doesn't know much, and so she's asking you for guidance with the region. What it was, we do it is, was edible. Uh, well, I know that that's edible. I never oh. tried mixing it with food before. Well, what we do is we'll go back and we'll, we'll like. Try a little bit and then try it with some food and then figure out what its flavor profile is and what it will work well with. Oh, man, you're dropping all kinds of new insight into my cooking game. Yeah. That's dope. 
Careful using words like profile and flavor around you. <laughs> I don't get it. <laughs> More, it's two syllables. It's too many. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> Juice a one syllable kind of guy. Oh. It's too, you use too big of words, it starts to hurt his brain. You, you, know, you he, heard yourself say the word syllable, right? Taste dream. <laughs> it's your taste dream. Oh, man, my <clears throat> taste dreams? Yeah. Okay. <laughs> Wilster, so they're out there. Yeah. You notice um, <laughs> sitting on Ophi's shoulder, looking down at you, is your rat just staring at you? Oh man, like, I thought I'd lost him. Like he's staring through you. He's wait, <sighs> like he's waiting for you to make a move. He's just staring at you. I'm gonna whisper to him. What do you want? A piece of vermin? Is she ever gonna go away? He just looks at you and goes. I throw a pebble at it. <laughs> <laughs> uh yep he you know that 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 is pretty much all he's doing uh, he hits opie in the face and opie's face falls <laughs> opie's nose falls <laughs> opie's nose. oh no no, no, no. <laughs> so if i get up and walk over behind the horse does the rat follow um he just watches you he's watching not on you he's He's, I guess he's, I don't know, wants to be on Ophi's shoulder for some reason. I figure. So he... Um, oh, I don't ever want to to flesh. <laughs> uh, Marigold basically just tends to her, like, hide armor and patches it up and sharpens up a weapon that she's got, a stone weapon. And the way she start, sharpens it is on this leather strap, so it doesn't make a lot of noise. And uh, actually, you guys wouldn't notice at all. Both of you start to the world's just grows a little bit bright. And uh, Wilster, you're you went behind the horse, but I'm still watching. Yep. Um, you can see Ophi, and you can see that the horses are like tied around your neck. No, no, oh no, no! I, I earlier I untied the horses and and tied them to a tree. Oh, okay. <laughs> Looking for ways to take Opie out. No, no, no. no, no, no. <laughs> Good job. Hmm. Ophi, um, uh, the last thing Ophi yeah. remembers is getting attacked by a not a chicken. So mm -hmm. I think she's going to scramble backwards. Okay, so you definitely see that Wilster. There was such a gradual change in her coloration that you didn't see that but you've seen you see her like stumble backwards she's on her feet and and uh, right, i'm gonna run up to her and i'm gonna grab her i'm gonna say it's okay it's okay it's i'm gonna okay. slap his hand <laughs> no it's okay okay it's okay um how much of my robes are ripped it's about like a three inch gash in them she's like covering the rip okay she swats his hand where's away the, where's the rat the rat hops off of Ophi and onto you when you come up close and scrabbles down the inside of your clothes. There. Telling <laughs> me. You feel its claws. Ophi is not rested. Nope. No. And you're injured still. Damn. But you mm. probably all, except for Lom, who would be working out, will have seen this interaction. Is there like blood oozing out of my wounds? Yes, there is definitely sort of, sort of plasmic fluid. Oh. Tip it, tip it, look, Ophie moving again. Oh. I saved her. Leo did a great no, job. I didn't save her. Oh. We'd, we'd, I'd rush over. It just wears off. Where, oh, yep, yeah, it does. What? You rushed over? Yeah, yeah. I rushed over. Ophi! She just like scrambles away from juice. Ophi, you back again, man. You have everybody so worried. She's um she's like trying to like cover up her wounds and like 
like to wipe away the it's like almost like a it's like a greenish fluid but it's almost like glowing bioluminescent and it's she's just trying to like wipe it off on her robes and like get away you okay Ophi? you need help juice help juice good at help you need bandages um Ophi nods at wilster Give her some of those new fancy bandages you bought from the elves. Okay, okay, yeah, here, here. I've got bandages. That's <laughs> good for covering up your hurts. Um, she rolled. Uh, she she's pretty good at bandaging, bandaging herself right. up. You very successfully bandage yourself up. <laughs> All covered. I don't know up. how much bandage I'm supposed to have. You have one. <laughs> one bit less. The, than talking you about did. the clothes. I was talking about the clothes you got. Oh, no, I thought it was silk bandages. <laughs> the yeah, those fancy oh, bandages. They, yeah. You guys got healing stuff, too. Yeah. They, they gave you everything that you wanted, at least. Um, Did you kill the chickens? Who are you talking to? Um, She's going to tap Lom on the... Oh, Lom's already... She, oh, he's I'm, over there doing... Yeah, the, yeah, yeah 20, we're not... Yeah, away. she's going to ask um, uh, Juice. Did you kill the chickens? Oh, yeah, yeah. We, we should, I killed them so good. I, they're dead. I, they're real dead. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. And I sit there. I like, I first pull out the beak and I kind of unwrap it as I see. And then I like point up into the tree. There's pieces of chicken hanging in the tree. Chicken. Yeah, we chicken. We killed that bird thing real good. Like, and then I wrap it up and put it the beak back in. Um, she, uh, she's going to uh, like take her bearings and then um, inspect uh the human <laughs> that is suddenly joined yeah our, our uh, uh, little you, ensemble you do recognize that that she shaped just like that statue that you came down you because you observed the statue very closely the statue's awake <laughs> both of them <laughs> there's an irony there <laughs> <laughs> you know i'm gonna lean over to tidbit and say you know i wasn't convinced it was only gonna be 24 hours for all we know that other one could have been here a week i'll walk up <laughs> <laughs> to hear that. Yep. <laughs> Ophi, d did it hurt being rock? A what? Did it hurt being a rock? I, I was what? You were made of stone. What? That monster bird thing it went crazy and it clawed at you. And then next thing we know, you just standing there and you're all gray. You know, talk to no one's. What? What day is it? Uh, it's it's like next day. I'll tell you the true true. It, you was rock. You was not like a a thing anymore. You're heavy as shit. I've never been a rock before. Not like the big bird. Yo, no, no not like big bird. No. No, you was not a bird. You was just a rock. Yes, I was just a rock. My friend, I have some things for you that you missed while you were a rock. Yes. Here is a feather. Ah. Oh. From the one we killed. Oh, she takes it and she's here like... Here is a scale. <laughs> and here is a tooth from a big crocodile. A, cro a crocodile? Yes. Oh, and then like like hearing the crocodile, it goes off. I was like, oh, oh yeah, yeah, yeah. And I like run over and like make her a fresh sandwich. <laughs> Did she like <laughs> kick over the sandwich that was at her feet? Probably so. Yeah, it fell off. <laughs> it kind of puddled into the, the, the lom. Ophie, the, like, the loam. Yeah, Ophie, like, yeah, cherishes her gifts. Like, she puts them in her satchel. Mm -hmm. Oh, you should try this gator. Tidbit showed me a new trick where you sprinkle grass and stuff on it. It <laughs> makes it taste real good. <laughs> Did she do the stank toe? <laughs> <laughs> no, no. <laughs> 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 I can't. <laughs> <laughs> Go there. <laughs> oh, my God. <clears throat> okay. Well, what time is all this going on now? This is afternoon. After afternoon. <laughs> it's 24 hours yeah. past the last afternoon. Okay. Well, I say we, we get a move on from this place. We've been standing around way too long. What y'all thinks? Sounds good to me. 
Long, you you been swinging that blade long enough? You ready to go? Well, yeah, we could go. But we're not going to get far before it's time to set up camp again. Well. And then we'll have to set up camp again. We'll, we'll that, have to tear down this camp first and then uh, set up camp again. That so is true. We may as well stay. I mean, we know this area. We know our surroundings. I don't we think so. We may as well stay here till the morning. No? No. There's blood everywhere. Yeah, that's... It's mostly soaked into the ground now. There is like blood. blood. I don't There's know, just man. blood over there. We'll There's still no blood over there. Blood. There's over by what? the fire. Blood by the crocodiles. Blood by we gotta get going. <clears throat> Will still, what you thinking, Will still? You think I mean, you know, I normally know stick around in the same place too long. It's not yeah, normally. we should probably at least move for a couple of hours. Yeah, I, I know you I I know what you say, Long. You know, it sucked to do so much work, it seemed for nothing. But I tell you the true true. That's why tribes always stay moving. You can't stay out and open. It's been a day. I'm telling you, that's long. I'll help Bear tear it down. Okay. I promise, Lom. We know, we know, steal you to Wh- the wrong. Whatever. You can Let's keep exercising, Lom. <laughs> okay. So you guys break camp and mm-hmm. get back on the road. <laughs>